Chapter 257 The sweetness was just right. After a long time, they separated. Su Jingting was full of smiles. He liked Jie Yishan's flushed face when she was teased. He couldn't help but place his big hand on her cheek, feeling warm. Was the heating in the room a little too much? The deep voice sounded again. Do you think we should add salt? Jie Yishan was speechless. How was she supposed to answer when she was so embarrassed? Su Jingting saw that she was silent and slowly lowered his head. Do you want to taste it again? Jie Yishan was speechless. She struggled to break free from Su Jingting and said, No need to add salt. The sweetness is just right. He slipped away. Back in the bedroom. Jie Yishan leaned against the door and covered her face. What was she saying? Adding salt was saltiness. How was it related to sweetness? It was so embarrassing. Why couldn't she resist the temptation of Mr. Sue? Shaken back to her senses and lipped through the crack in the door. Film Empress Sue giggled like a young boy, his fingers still on his lips. Then, he turned around to cook the soup. Jie Yishan closed the bedroom door again and jumped onto the small bed. Su Jingting was in a very good mood. He looked at the menu from beginning to end. He carefully observed the color of the ribs cooked in the pot. According to his calculations, they were already 87% cooked. They still needed to simmer for another 15 minutes and 30 seconds. The phone rang again, and the name Suyuji on the screen had jumped countless times. Su Jingting was in a rare good mood and answered the call. On the other end of the phone, Suyuji couldn't believe that his brother had picked up the phone. He shouted excitedly, Brother, you finally picked up the phone. What's the matter? When are you coming back? If you don't come back soon, I'm really going to die. Everyone is asking me if you have a girlfriend. Dad and mom booked a plane ticket to go on vacation and left me behind. Oh. Su Jingting responded. Sub, sub, sub. In the only one in the entire house now. One don't have anything to eat. You're already an adult. You have to learn to take care of yourself. Brother, are you at little Shanshan's place? Can I come over and freeload? Freeloading was only an excuse. Hiding from those people was Su Yuji's ultimate goal. Su Jingting did not answer. Su Yuji was anxious. Brother. Today is the first day of the new year. If you go to a company sister-in-law, what should one do? Am I still your dear brother? Su Jingting's hand, which was holding the spoon, had not been idle. When he heard Su Yuji's words, he paused for a moment and said lightly, you don't have to be either. Su Yuji was speechless. Was she abandoning him? She didn't even want to break his legs. Su Yuji, who was on the other end of the phone, was in a low mood and felt wronged. Immediately after, Su Jingting did not intend to stop. Find a girlfriend and have a good time. Su Yuji recalled all the girlfriends he had. He could remember their names, but not their faces. He could remember their faces and not their names. If he had to match them one by one, it would be best to give each X a QR code and scan them one by one. Brother, I haven't met a suitable one yet. One beg you not to rush me. Her father was urging her. Her mother was urging her. And her biological brother was not letting her go. She was really going to die. Think about it carefully. I'm cooking for your sister-in-law. Brother, hey. Hey, hey, the call was cut off. He didn't get to eat, but he got a mouthful of dog food. When did his brother learn how to cook?